Greetings, Earthlings. My name is Dallas, and I'm crazy and fun all in one. This is my brother Dylan. He's crazy too, I guess. And this is our mom. You can tell she loves the attention. This is our dad. He is the exact opposite. Either way, this is our ginormous and crazy family. Hope you enjoy our daily lives. Hey guys, we have no AC in our house, so we're like burning up. Everyone's like shirtless, brushing their teeth. Okay, so anyways, it is really ridiculously hot in our house. And um, I think what we're gonna do is try to leave the house because no one's in the house because it's so freaking hot. So what do you wanna do now, Lee? I don't know. What'd you say earlier? What? What'd you say just now? No. God, why do you always like change it whenever the camera comes on? Come on, dude. <sighs> I'm like sweating right now. I didn't realize how hot it is. Holy cannoli. I'm gonna brush my teeth now. <gasps> okay, I think what we're gonna do is gonna go to Barnes and Nobles and probably like study and stuff. Waiting for Dylan's appointment to start at 2 30. <sighs> Man, it's so freaking hot. I bet it's it feels better outside than inside the house. And that's saying something. Dylan, don't forget your shades. Yo, shady shades. Look at this cripple. Oh, you just hopped like four stairs. Can you do that, Lee? I can do like this. Dang, bruh. Almost ran into the wall. Okay. Let's do this. Oh yeah, it feels a lot better out here because there's a breeze. Oh yeah, we're just gonna chill in the car with the AC on. How is that what she said, man? We eating burgers at Dylan's doctor. You making a beat with your ice? You did ran out of drink, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're going upstairs. It's 2.20. We're gonna go see the family medicine. I think that's what it is. Oh, pediatrics. Dude! How come every time you eat, you always gotta do that? Yeah, yeah every time. <laughs> Do it again for the camera. Do it for the camera. Man, you suck at this. Doctor Do office. What is ADD or? Come on, man. You, now it looks like you're an adult. You have to fill out your own forms. Do I have ADHD? No. <laughs> what kind of question? You I, should know what you have. Allergies, yeah. Allergies. No, you don't have like peanut food allergies. I think that's what they mean. Anyway, we're at the doctor's and we were playing anxiety. eight ball, right Lee? He Ang beat me. What is anxiety? Eight, eight like when you get nervous and you like start to freak out and stuff. Come on, man. Come on. Yeah, you don't have that. No. Do you wet the bed? Bladder or kidney infection? No broken bones? No. No cancer? Chicken pox. <laughs> no concussion. No. Lee thought it in here. What's it was called like, constipation? It's that not bad, right? Constipation. Like, like when you can't poop. Have I ever had a real constipation? Or you should know it's your body. I don't think I oh my gosh, dude. What is diabetes mellitus? Just give me this. What is mellitus? Mean? <laughs> what? He's not. You're going. Go by yourself. If you don't know, let me know, okay? <laughs> Papa Wheelie, Dylan, Papa Wheelie. Wait, let me get in front of you. Papa Wheelie, Dylan. Papa Wheelie, Dylan. Papa Wheelie, Dylan. Now we're going to the x ray center. Get his foot x rayed. Okay, here's the door. 
<laughs> Come on, dude, it's like driving. She's <laughs> Dylan, you're Drake now. Your wheelchair Jimmy. <laughs> Papa Wheelie Lee. Trying coffee for the first time, guys. Well, not really for the first time. Lee, you like this little situation you got here? <laughs> We're like in the little kids section. We're not even that little. <sighs> We're still at the doctor's office. <laughs> Just chilling, and my phone's at two percent. Cause I killed it. Because you've been doing it on a Snapchat. Snapchat. You know what's saying? Snapchat's life. <laughs> Whatever. That one girl said Snapchat's life. Dylan got a boot. He's a cowboy now. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have to reassemble it. So. Chilling in the garage because it's so freaking hot everywhere else. Just get edit this video today. Man, I had to do so much stuff today for Dylan, for his doctor thing. Turns out his foot is actually fractured, so he won't be able to play basketball for like six weeks. And I had to call the insurance, call the doctor, do all this adult stuff. Being adult sucks. If you're watching this and you're a little kid, stay a little kid because it sucks whenever, once you hit 18, bam, all these responsibilities get poured over you and you're like drenched in drenched in sorrow. <laughs> Kayla just said come over on group. I sent this picture of me chilling in the garage. Just right now, it's right now, it's happening guys. It's like inception. And then she sent me this picture, come over. <laughs> it's like blowing in her face. <laughs> How can you breathe in this sauna, my dear cat? How can you live? <sighs> I'm dying. <laughs> So I was chilling in the garage, right? And right as I, as soon as I hit the step right here, you feel all this hum humidity hit you and you're like, oh, is this a sauna? Like, it's so freaking hot. I just can't believe it. Look, we're trying to open the windows, get the fan going, but dang, I just came up here and I'm already sweating. Hey guys, so I think at the end of my vlogs, what I'm gonna start to do is probably reflect on the day on my day and how I felt that day. Today, when I took Dylan to the doctor, it was nice. Um, my mom, at the end of the day, whenever I took him to the doctor and whatnot and found out everything, got that boot for him, she's like, I'm proud of you for taking care of your brother like that. And I've never heard those words utter from her mouth at all. And I'd say I'm a pretty good big sister. I mean, I, I would bend over backwards just to give him food or whatnot and it was just like really nice hearing it from someone else especially my mom who doesn't hand out compliments like just like candy and today it was really it was nice I think it was really nice that that I took my brother out and I took care of him and I got that all done for my mom and the fact that I had that coffee, which I don't normally do, I don't pick up coffee at all, but I think my mindset was kind of like, okay, I'm basically mom right now, so let me just do mom things. And what she does is drink coffee in the middle of the day, just like for the heck of it. And I even added Splenda, that's her favorite sugar. So yeah, today was, we spent like three hours in doctor's office. It was not fun, it was not fun at all, but I'm glad that we were out of the house, away from the heat and whatnot. I say whatnot a lot, huh? I'm glad we were away from the heat, because it was, like, really bad. Whenever you would hit that, that third step on the stairs, man, you were gone. I was like, I couldn't even breathe. And, um, yeah, that's how I felt about today. 
maybe I'll start doing these. I'm not sure. I kind of like it because people don't really ask how you are every day. And if I do it to the vlogs, then it's basically like keeping myself sane, you know? It's like a journal. And that's what vlogs are, basically. They're video vlogs. And um, it'd be nice to see this in the future, like my kids watching it. And they'll be like, wow, this is how she felt that day. It's like a diary. I don't know, is it cheesy? I don't know. But um, I'm editing the new vlog now. I already have the other one uploaded, which I hope gets a lot of views, I pray. Because the one about my butt has like 200 something views and I don't know why. Um, yeah, good day today. Every day is a good day if you just have that attitude to have a good day. And today was, it could have been stressful because I had to call the insurance company, wait like 30 minutes on the phone listening to freaking like elevator music. And you know, it could have been like, I was kind of pissed off, but it could have been much, much more worse. But if you have the right attitude, the right mindset that day, you'll be like, Hey, it wasn't even that bad today. No one died. No one got hurt. Well, Dylan got hurt, but no one is in a life or death situation, and I appreciate that. Yeah. Good night, guys. See y'all tomorrow.